Hello everyone. Are you curious about whether you can see other countries from Antarctica? Let's explore. Antarctica, the southernmost continent on Earth, is a vast and remote landmass characterized by its icy landscapes, extreme weather conditions, and unique ecosystem. With its desolate and uninhabited terrain, Antarctica is often regarded as a place of isolation and solitude, far removed from the rest of the world. But can you see other countries from Antarctica? The answer to this question is not as straightforward as it may seem. Firstly, it's essential to understand the geography of Antarctica and its surrounding regions. Antarctica is surrounded by the Southern Ocean, which separates it from the southern coastlines of South America, Africa, and Australia. The continent itself is divided into several regions, including East Antarctica, West Antarctica, and the Antarctic Peninsula, each characterized by its distinct landscapes and climate. From certain vantage points along the coastlines of Antarctica, particularly on the Antarctic Peninsula, it is indeed possible to see other landmasses across the Southern Ocean. On clear days with good visibility, observers may catch glimpses of distant shorelines, mountain ranges, and even settlements on nearby islands or coastal regions. However, these views are typically limited to areas where the Antarctic coastline is relatively close to other landmasses, such as the South Shetland Islands or the tip of the Antarctic Peninsula. Moreover, the visibility of other countries from Antarctica depends on various factors, including weather conditions, atmospheric clarity, and the elevation of the observer's location. Dense fog, low-lying clouds, and storms can obscure distant views, limiting visibility and making it difficult to see other landmasses across the Southern Ocean. Additionally, the curvature of the Earth plays a significant role in determining how far one can see from a given point on Antarctica's coastline, with the horizon limiting the range of visibility. Furthermore, the vast majority of Antarctica's interior is inaccessible to the general public and only accessible to scientific researchers and expedition teams. These remote and inhospitable regions are characterized by vast ice sheets, glaciers, and polar deserts, with no permanent human habitation. As such, the question of whether you can see other countries from Antarctica is largely moot for most visitors to the continent, who typically remain near established research stations and coastal outposts. However, it's essential to note that Antarctica is governed by the Antarctic Treaty System, a multinational agreement that regulates activities on the continent and promotes scientific research, environmental conservation, and international cooperation. Under the terms of the treaty, Antarctica is designated as a continent for peace and science, with strict regulations in place to protect its fragile ecosystems and minimize human impact. As such, visitors to Antarctica are subject to stringent guidelines and restrictions aimed at preserving its pristine environment and ensuring the safety of both humans and wildlife. In conclusion, while it is technically possible to see other countries from certain vantage points along the coastlines of Antarctica, the visibility of distant landmasses depends on various factors such as weather conditions, atmospheric clarity, and the observer's location. For most visitors to Antarctica, the experience of exploring the continent is defined not by distant views of other countries but by the breathtaking landscapes, unique wildlife, and sense of isolation that characterize this remote and extraordinary land. Whether gazing out across the southern ocean or trekking through the frozen wilderness, the allure of Antarctica lies not in what can be seen from its shores but in the awe-inspiring beauty and wonder of the continent itself. The question of whether you can see other countries from Antarctica is one that fascinates many people curious about the remoteness and isolation of the southernmost continent on Earth. While it is technically possible to catch glimpses of distant landmasses from certain vantage points along Antarctica's coastlines, the visibility of other countries depends on various factors such as weather conditions, atmospheric clarity, and the observer's location. As such, the experience of exploring Antarctica is defined not by distant views of other countries but by the breathtaking landscapes, unique wildlife, and sense of adventure that await those who venture to this frozen wilderness. The goal of this channel is to answer all the questions in the world in video format. After we achieve it, when you search for anything on internet, you will be able to watch a video answering your question instead of reading an article. However, if we want to achieve our goal of answering 1 million questions, we need your help. Please support us on Patreon by using the link in the description. In exchange, we will feature your name in up to 1,000 videos every single month. Thank you for watching. Please like the video, follow the channel for more related content, and see you later. Goodbye.